This video introduces the individual connection feature used to insert a single or many side plate connections. The individual connection tool is useful when connections are not grid matched or need to be reinserted. To begin, open your Tecla model and the side plate tool. Then, click the individual connection tab. Press the select members button to begin the Tecla selection command. Help text displays in the bottom left-hand corner of the Tecla window. The first selection should be the column that the connection needs to attach to. Then, select one or multiple beams that create the connection. After selecting the column and beams, press the middle mouse button to indicate you are finished selecting objects. Now, in the individual connection window, a list of possible connection IDs displays. Reference the current drawing to verify the correct ID, especially when there are multiple IDs to choose from. Select the correct ID from the list and then click Apply Connection. The system inserts the connection. The Connections Available function lists the quantity for every component ID. And each time a connection is inserted, the quantity decreases. When all connections are complete, the connections available display zero. Note that the connections available function does not synchronize with the XML file if a connection is deleted. To insert a connection ID with a quantity of zero, use the Y button. After clicking this button, a list of recorded connections from the XML is displayed. To the right of each ID, applicable grid lines and the elevation are displayed. Click the Zoom button to locate the connection in the model. Use this process to progress through each entry and locate entries that are not actually in the model. When you identify one of these connections, enter a check mark in the delete box. After identifying all connections that are not in the model, click the Delete Selected Connections button. This removes the selected entries from the XML, allowing the ID to be reinserted. 